finding a new suit is first on Teddy Purcell's shopping list after a whirlwind trip to Tampa. Do you have like a list in your head of the things that you need to buy? Uh, I have a lot of stuff back in LA, you know, uh, obviously being on the road so much, I need a lot of business casual stuff. And I came in here and I told the guy specifically, I want one black suit, I want to be quick and out of here. I'm definitely 16. Right. And I like this tie. Yeah, I like that tie too. How's it look? We need a girl's opinion. That would look good on you. I'm and just looking. He, yeah, I could tell he was looking at your coloring. Looks, he knows what he's doing. Looks sharp. Absolutely. All right, let's go with it. I had a list uh, narrowed down to one, but now it's uh, opened up a little bit more. So you got some more shopping to do. I think so. Yeah. Uh, I only want one suit, but uh, I think I need a couple pairs of jeans, some shoes, and some shorts too. Quick in and out. I like it. People don't always realize, you know, how much more you guys have to handle in a situation like this when your life is kind of turned upside down. Yeah, for sure, you know, uh, we were talking about it before of, of how ha things happen so quick. People just think, oh, you get traded, you, everything's moved for you, it's so easy, you know, and they don't realize that you, you come from, you know, you switch your fingers and you're on another team with, with no clothes and no car, no place to live, you're in a hotel and, uh, you know, walk into the rink. What have the last 48 hours been like for you? I think it's finally starting to set in, you know. Uh, they've been obviously, things happen really quick, and I've learned that in this business over the last 48 hours, like you said, you know, uh, it's only a couple of days ago, I was in Nashville with the LA Kings, and now I'm here in, uh, in Tampa. Tell me about last Wednesday afternoon when you were uh, sitting in the locker room, then an LA King. <laughs> That's a good story. I think I'm gonna remember for a long time. Uh, I was actually uh, just about to go on the ice with practice with the guys. We're all sitting around TV watching Trade Center like like every player does on deadline day. And uh, said Jeff Halpern was going to the Tampa Bay Lightning. So we were all, it did, but it didn't say for who. So, um, you know, I, every, obviously everyone around, around, around the league knows he's a good player. So uh, we were like, oh, we're pretty excited about it. And then two minutes later, they came on TV again and said Teddy Purcell's going the other way. So How quickly were you on a plane? Uh, I found out about lunchtime, 12 o'clock. I got in touch with some of the Tampa guys, said by the guys in LA, and I was on my way to Washington to meet the guys at 6 o'clock. What's in your suitcase? Oh, that was the easy part. We were on a, on a road trip and uh, for two games, so I brought two pairs of underwear, two pairs of socks, one suit, dress shirt, and this polo shirt. Families back in Canada? Yeah, family are back in Newfoundland. Uh, they found out the same way as me over, over the internet too, uh, and the TV. I didn't even have a chance to call them and let them know. Um, but they're excited about the move for me too, the new opportunity, and uh, they, they like the LA weather and visiting me out there. So now I think I'll have a lot more visitors that's a little more closer to home here down in Florida.